Today is Wednesday, November 18th. Please get ready to recite the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. During class today, please remember the Johnny K commitments. I am ready, I am respectful, I am responsible. Good morning, Johnny K Jaguars. I'm Zoe Saint, and the weather for today is going to be sunny and windy. The humidity levels will be at 48. The wind will be going 11 miles per hour. Stay safe and have a good day. Bye. My question is, why is the sky blue? Wow, that is a good one. I mean, why isn't it red? Or purple? Or gold? Or... Sorry, I'm getting ahead of myself here. Basically, there are these things called wavelengths. Wavelengths are a part of nature that explain how we see light. It's a wave! No figure. It's wild, right? The sun is actually white, which matches up every single color you can think of. Bet you didn't know that. So when the sun's white light reaches Earth and becomes part of our atmosphere, it's a bit of a hard time passing through. Basically, there's a lot of stuff in our air that you can't see, which doesn't mean it isn't there. You've got dust, smog, all kinds of gross stuff, and the bits that make this gross stuff up are called particulates. And seeing as the sun's white light is every color, then why isn't the sky white? Yeah, why is that? Well, blue light is a little stubborn, and bounces those particulates around even more than the other colors, which results in us having a big, beautiful blue sky. That's awesome! Not only is it awesome, but it's related to how we see rainbows. What? Yeah, when the sun's light hits millions and millions of raindrops, it gets split up, letting us see all those colors all at once. That's so cool! Thanks, Noah! What's your favorite color? Should the sky be blue, green, orange, anything? Tell us in the comments below, and see you next time. Hi Johnny King, I'm Andrew Hussain, and I'm back with facts about cats. Did you know cats can jump five times their height? Also, kittens have 24 teeth, while adult cats have 30 teeth. Cats save a lot of energy by sleeping for the whole day. Also, cats are the only mammals who don't taste sweetness. Well, that's all for today. See you soon. Stay safe. Welcome to today's tips. Today we have a health tip. That is, be a role model for good hand washing. It can keep your family from getting sick. Oh well. Bye now. Good morning, Johnny Cake. This is Armani coming to you live from my kitchen. November is Native American Heritage Month. Today, I will present you two facts about Native American Heritage Month. Fact number one. Every November since 1990, the United States celebrates Native American Heritage Month. The commemoration of the month provides a platform for Native Americans to share traditions, music, crafts, and dance with others. November is Native American Heritage. Fact number two. November is Native American Heritage Month, or as it is commonly referred to, American Indian and Alaska Native Heritage Month. The month is a time to celebrate rich and diverse cultures, traditions, and histories to acknowledge the important contri contributions of Native people. That's all for today, folks. See you next time. I'm Mary Shaw in Mitch Tower, fourth grade class. We want to wish the following Jaguars a happy birthday for the, the week of November 8th for November 14th. Logan Baker, Sarah Alcati, Awada Tillman, Mari Davis, Shania Wiggins. Marie and Wiggins. Uh, 
Hida Eid Ashad, John Hopkins, Brianna Weir Inez, Myra Nod, Abel Cabrera Weir Nod, Oops, Lea Kari Marshall, Diamond Gibson. Happy birthday everyone!